So guys, the first thing we're gonna dive into in Sandbox 2.0.4 is Chaos Reach. This is the new Stormcaller Super brought to us here in Forsaken. And yesterday, we actually got in the sandbox updates that an issue of it was fixed, where it was actually dealing less damage on lower frame rates. As a result, players may now notice an increase in total damage output. This is a really big deal for us here on console, considering we're capped at 30 frames per second. First up, shout out to my clanmate Dimitri for letting me get on his account. He has Geomac, which is the main thing that I wanted to combine here because, hey, why not? Chaos Reach got a buff. Let's see how much it got a buff. Combine it with essentially the best exotic that pairs with this subclass. Let's do a refresh on Geomac. Close enough is the intrinsic perk. When Chaos Reach super energy is almost full, sprinting tops it off. Damaging enemies with Chaos Reach extends its duration. Now, how much is that duration? I, I should have reviewed this more specifically the last time I reviewed it. It it actually doubles the duration. Without Geomag, when doing consistent damage, your super lasts four seconds. With Geomag, you are now able to last a total of eight seconds. Listen to me, fellas. I'm not saying Chaos Reach isn't good on its own, but when you go from lasting four seconds to eight seconds, magical things happen here. And some people say, well, that's only eight seconds, but listen to me, guys. Sometimes you just need a second or more. You just need a second or two to get the job done. Geomag allows How's that? So first up, let's talk damage numbers. Went back to the drawing board, went over there to Greg, and we were hitting somewhere between 10,472 to 11,968 damage per second. Now, the reason why there's deviation between the numbers there is, well, things start to get really fuzzy. You can only imagine what it's like calculating numbers on a machine that's only spitting things out at 30 frames per second. It kills the eyes. But that was the numbers that we were coming with. And with Geomax, this could total somewhere around 83,000 damage to 96,000 damage. Now, the reason why this is so significant is because the last time I was actually looking at Chaos Reach, instead of the damage numbers popping up every five to six frames, instead it seemed like it was hitting every nine to 10 frames, maybe even more, which is why I think Bungie tweaked whatever it was to allow the damage here on consoles actually output what it's supposed to. And I really believe that Chaos Reach got a significant buff because from using it previously, I never saw it doing as much damage as it's doing and yes the damage numbers themselves are the same it's the reflection in the numbers it's the numbers that are actually popping up more often now as you can see right here from chaos reach yes it's doing some massive amounts of damage and the super itself is meant for you to be doing consistent amount of damage that damage is what actually makes the super last longer. Matter of fact, if you pop your super while using Geomax, it's the same duration. It's when you're actually doing the damage itself is what's keeping that super bar refreshing as you continually do more DPS. I gotta brag about Dimitri's account real quick. First up, he has an enhanced ashes to asset, which is gain even more super energy on grenade kills. Pairs wonderfully well here with storm grenades. Secondly, he had three different super mods on his armor which is actually a total reduction there of 58 seconds in your super. Pairing that something with Geomag is absolutely disgusting. Oh, but wait, he's got Dynamo on his Geomag stabilizers, which I have actually been looking at. It seems to significantly bump that super up on class abilities that have much longer cooldowns. So for something like a Warlock, it's a significant bump in your super when popping your Rift. And despite Dynamo and stuff getting a nerf where you have to be in proximity of your enemies, I don't have a problem with that. I'd normally pop my riff when I am close to my enemies. So needless to say, guys, I had my super all the time. And when you have a super with this type of damage output, with zero to no setup, that's the thing. That's the beautiful thing about it. This isn't like Burning Maul where I have to go and get three stacks and make sure Biotic Enhancements is activated in order to get that super to its fullest potential. This is just you jumping up and pop in your super. And it's about the easiest super to control. Now for PvP, I would say it's just up to the user. I mean, there's a learning curve to it. You are kind of stuck out whenever you pop this super. The good thing is, is that anything that you look at, you pretty much decimate. The bad thing is if there's enemies out there that just knows how to hide when you pop this super, there's nothing you can do because once you pop it, you can't really move. So to me, I feel like it's a super that can definitely be baited. So guys, overall, Chaos Reach has got a significant bump in damage. Damage. It's doing a lot better. It's reflecting the numbers that it's supposed to be reflecting. And this setup right here that I'm using, Geomag, all of these perks, Dynamo, Super Mods, Ashes to Assets. This is the combination of perks here on Chaos Reach that can turn some of our most dedicated players to their classes to Warlock. 
I'm not saying I'm gonna put a dress on, all right? I'm not saying I'm gonna join them. But if your man asked to cross, got Geo Max today, I don't know. I don't know what I would do. The bacon in me says I would never leave Titan. But this is the level of power fantasy that I've always wanted to see here on a Stormcaller in PvE. So fellas, please try it out for yourself. If you've got Geo Mag in your vault, Get them out and use them because they make this super twice as nasty. And if you're like the rest of the 99% of us that have yet to get these exotics along with the other exotics, wait till after the 30th. Fellas and ladies, thank you all for coming and watching. And as always, slap that like button like your mama told you right. <laughs>